you learn so much from artists. I mean, the lessons from working with Pet Shop Boys were phenomenal because the innate understanding that they had of um, the way to do things, on the one hand, ma with massive creativity and you know breaking down barriers, but also commercially, was you know a template really. And so there was a, there was a lot learned there. The first time you meet Paul McCartney, you're meeting you know you're meeting a Beatle, and, and you never really get over that 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 the fact that this is a Beatle, and and, and I started working with him on stuff in 1986 when Richard Ogden was managing him and we, was, and we would put together an album called All The Best which was the best of and, and worked with him to just before when I left EMI really so uh, I was his man at EMI. He just made this album Flaming Pie which I think is one of his better um, solo albums of recent years. He's got some great songs on it and um, and he was really excited about it. And this is the thing, Paul McCartney gets really excited about his new music, and this is phenomenal. And so he said, you've got to come and listen to it, you've got to come and listen to it. Great, okay. Uh, so round at, at Soho Square, in his office, because he has his own, his own office there that he uses, that he probably pops into once every two months or whatever, and the DAT, D-A-T, the thing of the past, goes into the machine, and uh, he said, oh, sit down, sit down here. So we're both sat in front of the DAT machine, the speakers are there. And he plays the whole album from front to back with us more or less toe to toe, with him miming all the parts, pointing out bits here and there, singing along, giving you a bit of an anecdote now and again as to what this song is all about. And at the end of it, you think, my God, you know, this is, this is, you know, this is priceless. People would pay millions for, you know, to be here. And, you know, that, that you can't, you know, those moments are just, you've got to bottle them, really, haven't you? And it was a great album. I was able to say at the end of it, you know, it's, it's a fantastic album, Paul.